Welcome back to the annual Top 10 Wrangler Star Approved Christmas Buyer's Guide video. Well, I've done these since the Wrangler Barn days. I get a lot of requests about this time of year from wives and girlfriends and to for gift ideas. So we've got, here's my criteria. So when I was going through this, I thought, what is it that I would like to receive? If I received it, if I opened it up in a box, that I would be excited, super excited. And that's kind of what my criteria was. So we've got five under 50 and five over 50 in the top 10. So we'll jump right in here, starting with number one. Boy, this is a perennial classic right here. $6, let's see if we're gonna open. I'm, I'm uploading a video right now. So it might be a little bit so slow. $6 for the Lansky dual grit sharpener. You know, there's a lot of sharp, fancy sharpeners out there. I mean, I've shown them, I own them, but really the reality of it is, is, is if it, it, with this tool right here, with this, it's got coarse on one side, it's got fine on the other, you can do everything. You can do knives, you can do your axes, you can do yard tools, you can do everything. It's very affordable, it's a great stock stocking stuffer, it's just a, an essential I item that everybody should have. And if this showed up in my stocking or in a Christmas box, I would be very happy. So that is number 10. We'll count down backwards. All right. So how do you access these? Go to wranglermart.com if you haven't seen on the top of the video right there. wranglermart.com is our Amazon affiliate page uh, that uh, I just put stuff that I like, stuff that I recommend or stuff that is asked about that I use in videos. Oh boy. Here's one of my favorites. One of my probably all time favorites for the whole year. One of them anyway. The Mora Knife Craftline Carpenter Chisel Carbon Steel Blade. I absolutely love this tool this tool was given to me by one of my subscribers at the mother earth news fair and what it is is it's a very affordable fifteen dollars and sixty six cents amazon prime with an excellent sheath if your if your husband or boyfriend is a carpenter or it doesn't have to be a woodworker or just likes to do diy around the house this is a tool that's indispensable this is a tool that is even transcending the toolbox for me by coming out that i'm noticing that when i've got a lot of stuff to do let's say i'm breaking down cardboard boxes or i'm scraping caulking off of some glass or i'm doing this or i'm you know got to fix that i have it i use it all the time wonderful wonderful tool jump on these because they'll be sold out quick uh, they really will. Wonderful tool. Fifteen dollars, sixty-six cents, free shipping. How can you beat that? Oh, here's another good one right here that I personally use: the Magpul iPhone case. Yeah, they make it for the big one. They make it for the little one. Some of those iPhone cases are so ridiculously expensive, and they're not very good. This one's the best. I mean, Magpul. I mean, you. It, they make all the great AR-15 accessories and uh, all that stuff. Why they make phone cases and iPad cases? I don't know. I, I've even got the iPad case here. I think that was like twenty dollars right there for the mini iPad that I used to fly my drones with. Ah, wonderful. If I got one of these, I would be happy. You can get them in all different colors, and I think. In my opinion, and I've had a lot of phone cases, this is the best one, one of the best ones out there. And a fraction of the price of some of those fancy ones. Fancy. You don't need the fancy ones, you just need that one. Uh, here's another perennial favorite right here. One of my favorite belts, and what a value. The Bison Design Last Chance Heavy Duty Nylon Web Belt with V-Ring Buckle. It's heavily inspired from the wildland firefighting type of type of belts that we well that we wear now this is not one of those fall rated buckles that the navy seal wears you know this is something that is just good for a day to day would you be able to use i mean one time for example i had this very belt on we went sledding and we were pulling jack when he was just a baby through these trails and i got tired of holding the rope i had that belt on i flipped it around backwards i hooked the carabiner to the d-ring and it saved the day these are great belts you can get them in all different colors they're listed down here we've got black and navy and desert tan and graphite and coyote and on and on and on but you should be able to find these for under eighteen dollars a great company a uh, great uh, customer service your man will be stoked he will be stoked all right what's next still under the fifty dollars range oh i cut them out of order here is one this this is good for 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 everyone uh even for the ladies this would be a great tool mrs w loves her rogue tools Rogue tools, you know, when you go buy garden tools in, in our big box stores and such, the quality of them is really plummeted. It's went downhill. Very disappointing. The quality of steel, the design, they're not really made too much anymore by people that actually use them. 
Here is the the exception. The rogue tool, tools, I have worked with them actually on wildland firefighting where the, you cannot put a greater demand on tools than in that environment. Almost everyone is switching to these tools. Not this specific one, but they're making them for specific wildland firefighting. I do use this one. I use this one. I have my own personal one. That's the one I use on fires. If you're a tall guy like myself, I'm 6'4", I have, you can get the long handles. You can get the long 60-inch handles so you don't have to bend over and get a creaky back all the time. Or you can get the normal length. They make uh, tools for just about anyone. This one is my favorite. If I was just going to have one for around the yard and the garden and weeding and, and such, it's the Pro Ho Field Ho, Pro Ho Field Ho, five, foot wide, five inches wide. It's a great tool. $50 shipped. Man, you just can't beat it. They're, they're a great company, too. I know the owners. Um, I've worked with them for years. Wonderful, wonderful tool. I'd be stoked uh, to get that. I'll tell you what. All right, now we're getting into the over $50 range. You know, of course, I had to put an axe in there, and there's so many good choices now. I mean, it really is the golden era, era of, of axes again. There's great manufacturers for really good money. And I thought, what is an axe that's going to appeal to the broadest range of people? Not everybody is a lumberjack, right? Not everybody needs a big American felling axe or a double bit. But I think it seemed to me what most people probably could use would be something that was a good short axe that you could carry in a backpack or a car or a truck or your camping gear that would be really good for around the camp type of tasks, sp i.e. splitting firewood. And what I chose, because I think it's such a wonderful value, you get so much for the money, is the Husqvarna. I always pronounce that wrong. Mrs. W, she speaks Swedish, and she says Husqvarna. And her mom says Husqvarna, so I kind of have adapted that. I grew up saying Husqvarna, uh, which they cringe each time I say that. Husqvarna is offering these wonderful hand-forged axes uh, from Sweden, proper Sweden steel, that are that are on par with your Halt Brooks, your Grand Force Brooks, I'm going to pair, with an exception, they don't have the fit and finish and they don't have quite a, as nice of a handle, but they're a third the price, sometimes half the price. But what you get is you get a good axe head with quality steel that will hold the edge. And as you know, my favorite steel is Swedish steel. I think they make the best axe heads. Well, they make the best of anything I've ever used. Wonderful. So this is a short handle, but it's got 20 inch handle, two pounds, and it's a splitter. It's, real, it's not a chopping axe, it's a splitting axe, but if you like to split kindling and do that type of thing, it's really great. You get a sheath, a nice handle, wonderful. They are absolutely wonderful tools. Husqvarna is not making them. One of the premier Swedish axe manufacturers are making them, but uh, that is $65 shipped. Oh man, to have that under the tree, I would be happy. I don't personally own this one. Uh, I own the bigger version of this, but I would love to have it. All right, moving on, moving on. What we got? Oh, man, this is a good deal right now. The Stanley, I love these chisels. These are the chisels that I use. The Stanley Sweetheart 750 set. Now, anyone who knows much about woodworking, you'll know that the classic Stanley video chisels, the 750s, they're just iconic. They were some of the finest and most loved chisels around. Well, I think, what was it, last year, two years, not very long ago, Stanley has reintroduced them, and you can buy them brand new now because they're hard to find, the old ones, and they're expensive. Right now, I would jump on this deal. They're half price. 80, they're normally $159.60. I found them for $82.99 on Amazon free shipping. And this is all you need. This is the set I have. Four chisels. What have you got? You've got your, no, it's not listed there. Quarter inch or half inch, three quarter and one inch, I think is what they are. Wonderful, wonderful tools. And if you have an inspired, there, there it is. Quarter, half, three quarters and one inch, yeah. Comes in a nice case too. This beautiful leather rollout case. I, I love these tools. They they give me the fizz every time I go out and use them in the shop. Wonderful. They have a bigger set if you want that. But I think for most people, I have never felt that I uh, that I've needed anything more than these. The Stanley 750s. What a great gift. Great great gift that would be. Next, what do we have next? Oh yeah. Uh, you know, you have, have you ever had something that you sold it and you kicked yourself? I kick myself about this. I, I had one of these before I was getting into woodworking. I bought it because I think I thought I needed a plane. It was before I really knew better uh, for my timber framing. And when I got it, it was just a little bit too small, and I ended up selling it back on eBay. 
but now I wished I would have had it. You know, you can restore the old ones, and the old ones are, are very nice, but they're getting hard to find, and they're getting then they're very expensive. But if you don't want to fool with that, and you just don't have time, and you want to get into good work, woodworking, and you want to have a really great the Toyota Camry of of tools. This is a great plane. I loved mine. It's uh, when you open it, it's very impressive. It comes in a nice box. Um, it, it's great. You know, it's a, you of course you can get better ones, but if you want to spend four or five hundred dollars, you know, I, I get that. I'm, I'm not saying that, but most guys don't. And if you want something that is a great tool that you'll really love, solid brass, great hardware, pretty well put together. Um, man, I would love one. I, I was thinking, actually, if Mrs. W was asking me what I'd like for Christmas. I, I, I might ask her for one of these. I think that these are great. $119, a little bit expensive, but a wonderful gift that would really be appreciated. I know I would. I would be very happy. And, well, what was that number? I lost track. We're going to go to the last one. The last one is a splurge item, but it's my fa one of my favorite things that I own. Can you guess? Of course. The Benchmade Osborne 940. If you were to ask me what knife was in my pocket right now, it would be this knife. I have carried knives since my very first charade old timer back in the day that my granddad gave me, the three blade. I carried those around forever and ever. It was way before the days of the of the clip knife. But through the years I have carried, I don't know, probably hundreds of different knives from every manufacturer this one is my favorite there's just nothing like it it is, is a design that has been around a long time but it's it's but it's it just it endures because it sells because people love it i every time i go out to the mother earth news fair many of you come up to me and you say i thanks for the recommendation of this knife it was a it was a bitter pill to swallow because it was so expensive 182 dollars for pocket knife it's ex I know, I bought. had to get two of them. I lost my other one. Mrs. W bought the second one, and I've loved it, loved it, loved it. You want to give, if you want to spend, you know, buy something really, really nice for your man, if he doesn't have one of these, I, I would just about guarantee you he will be very, very happy. And he'll spend the rest of the day fiddling with it and, and <laughs> flipping it up and open and close because it's a wonderful Wonderful tool, the 940 Osborne. I would recommend if you're if you are a, a heavy outside type of guy and you're in the brush and stuff, take the clip off. Uh, that's how I lost mine. Take the clip off and just keep it in your pocket like a regular pocket knife. It's so thin and so slight, you don't even know it's there. Like oh, if it's in my pocket, I don't even know it's there until I reach my hand in and feel it. But uh, a wonderful, wonderful knife, my all-time favorite. All right, so that is. The official Wrangler Star Top 10 Buyer's Guide. Buyer's Guide. Mrs. W has put her category there. So if you're looking for gifts for your woman, girlfriend or wife, she has picked her Top 10, which is also there. So go to WranglerMart.com uh, and everything will be there. It's all my favorite stuff and I change and add things all the time. So we appreciate that and we'll see you guys on the next video.